What's up? It's me, John here, and today we are going to be doing some Gold Guild SMP. So, uh, recently I, uh, found an Ice Spikes biome. Now, before, uh, here, wait, where, where am I going here? So, basically, this whole episode, I'm just gonna be heading back to spawn because, uh, the Ice Spikes biome is very far away from spawn, and that's kind of crappy, but... That's okay. I found an ice spikes biome, and basically, uh, uh, these two people, Orange Apple YouTube and Maximum Fire, both found an ice spikes biome, and basically, it was really controversial because they were keeping it from the rest of the group. And so now, uh, uh, now basically, I found one. And I negotiated with Linky. Here, I need to turn down my volume in a second. Wait, am I going the right way? Oh man, there's so many mobs chasing me right now. Okay, are we safe? Okay, so basically I negotiated with Linky and I got Silk Touch to pick so I can mine the ice spikes which is great because i'm using it in my new shop which i will show uh into the episode more and i uh got 20 diamonds so i just got oh it was awesome i mean they apparently have a better i don't even know a better ice spike biome or something but i don't really care uh, it's really awesome that I found this, uh, and that I could discover this, cause, like, that was my mission for a while, cause I knew I could get, like, high prices for it, so, really good stuff. I negotiated with Orange Apple and, uh, Maximum Fire to say I won't reveal the cords to anybody, uh, if... They give me 60% off in their new packed ice shop. Except, of course, the big little greedy kids. They're like, nope. So, that that's okay, because I did the right thing, I think. And I, yeah, I, I did good stuff. Okay. Let's do my render distance sound so I don't lag. Uh, that, that's just, like, amazing that I did that. I'm so glad that I found that, because I was literally just walking for an hour. I, like, well, I discovered a lot of things, but I was just walking for so long, and, oh, I can't believe I did it. I found it. I found the almighty ice biome. It is, it, it feels great to have that uh bargaining power over them so basically i have a uh, holy crap that guy's fast wow what the heck these lag spikes uh uh so i have a new shop coming out and it's basically gonna be my cords shop because i can i've noticed something i can just listen to music and uh well, it might be my chord shop, it might be something else, but I can listen to music and just, like, be just walking and just hold down space and W key and I'm fine. And, yeah, it, so I noticed that and then I'm like, I have to make a shop for chords because that, I didn't realize it, that chords have such a bargaining power, it's pretty awesome. So, yeah, that, that's going to be my new shop idea. And I don't think I'll have many competitors in that shop. Uh, I might make an, a uh, packed ice shop and kind of try to outrun Linky and Orange. Hopefully I can uh, team up with, like... I mean, not Linky and Orange. I can uh, outsail uh, Maximum and Orange. But if I can team up with Linky and make a shop with that, then that would be extra good because Linky's like the owner of the server. He's like swag central. 
Okay. Oh my. These mobs. I, I would say sleep or leave, except I'm the only one on. Okay. Okay, wait. Where's the moon at? It's going down. Okay, oh, that's good, that's good. So, uh, yeah, sorry if I'm gonna be running for a bunch of this episode. It's just kinda... It's gonna be a long trip. I'm also thinking... I don't know. No, that would take way too long. Oh, whose house is that? If that's someone's house, I may be able to, uh, nether portal. Back home. Oh, I wanna find... Uh, orange and maximums. Uh, I want to find orange and maximums. Holy crap. There. Uh, ice spike by him, because that just totally pissed them off, and it would be so funny. Whoa. This is a really weird thing. Oh, wow. I think I would have ran out of food if I didn't find this. Go, go, go. Duh. Do these guys still hate me? No, 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 they don't hate me. I killed one, like, a while ago. So I'm just making sure they don't want to destroy my brains. Okay, come on. Wow, this guy... Who, whose base is this even? Wow, am I gonna run out of food? Okay, I got two raw beef. Dang. Oh, da -da, da -da, da -da. No, I think jumping takes your hunger really quick. Holy crap. This person... Wow. They really went all out. Is this Aura's tree farm? Yeah, it is. Or whatever the... Oh, storage tower. Oh, that's what that is. Oh, okay, okay. Now I know a easier way to get there. That's good. Oh, we're here in spawn. So let me show you guys what I've been doing recently. And uh, we can take a little trip. So basically, they're making a little uh, court judging thing. I don't know. A court over there. I think it's a little bit of a weird idea, but whatever. Um, this is my new redstone shop. It's not open yet. I just need to get a few more supplies. But yeah, this is going to be my new shop. I need packed ice so I can like put it on the nether and it would look like pretty cool. So yeah, that's basically what I've been doing. I reserved that shop and I reserved this shop up here, which might, yeah, it might be something. Uh, Ferno, if you notice this new shop here, Ferno has been making, uh, he's been making, oh, the curse shop, it's open? Low cut curse over gross growth curse. Read if first time, okay, let's see this. Curse shop, intro, order your curse, important, okay. Intro. This is a curse shop. Basically, what you do here is pay for Inferno to lay a curse on a target. A curse is a large prank done on the target. I had the exact same idea of doing this. Target. Damage probably will simply just make the target survival a little more difficult. That is an amazing idea. I congratulate him. That. Wait. Okay, place. Low cut curse. 
overgrowth curse. Oh, I think I want, there's two types of curses. How do order curse? Okay. Important. Please know that. Chris is low, low cuss. So the target's crop are all mined out and placed in a nearby chest. Chicken, the target's. The target's base is an onslaught of eggs releasing baby, which is overgrowth. The target's lawn grows grass and trees everywhere. The vines, the target's base is coated with vines. Oh, those are, those are some nice. Oh, wow. I like the overgrowth seems the cheapest and best for its price. Uh, I, uh, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to be using some of this stuff on people. This is good. This is good. I'm glad that, uh, this server is kind of taking off. We're getting a little more creative with our shops and yeah, we're getting some more large scale, uh, shops, which is pretty nice here. Where am I going to go? I can't even run anymore. I like clutch that making it back I brought a ton of food to go look for the ice spikes by him but I had to kill a bunch of pigs on the way what the heck that guy I was like carrying that guy with me that was really weird okay holy crap G G orange I can't wait till Linky gets on gives me that silk touch because then my business will be off uh, I did some renovations to my house that I want to show you guys. So basically, if you, you can see I got two floors. The bottom floor, I'm not really uh, using for much, but it's just there for the fun. <laughs> I don't know. Everybody has, like, these gigantic houses and, like, cool-looking houses, and I just have this. Um, this... Yeah, I, I have a great ideas for houses, though, like, for, to put it into action is harder for me. Uh, yeah, I don't know why people need so many floors of, like, storage and whatever. I think it's a little pointless, but whatever. Okay. Look at all my stuff. I got a lot of iron, and it's awesome. Uh, I've been, ru I've been running out of iron. Recently, so I was like getting a little nervous, but then it was all good because I found some. Okay. Any food? Nope. Any food? Nope, but we can cook up this iron. Oh, more iron? Oh, yeah, I forgot I cooked this. I, I've been like mining like never before. I know people have like stacks and stacks and stacks of iron on the server, but whatever. Trying my best. I am going to definitely need to get more food. Uh, I'm planning on making a farm, like a bigger farm, because, I mean, I really like this carrot for farm I have going, though I don't have enough uh, carrots for it. So, yeah, see, look, we got, what, one, two... Three, four, five. What? Why is that only one? Fully grown. Okay. Six, seven. Okay. Yeah, not a lot of carrots are growing here. Carrot population is quite low. Okay. So, here's what I think I'm going to do about this. It's it's going to be hard because I'm running out of carrots. I'm going to buy carrots at a shop, probably. I also had a chicken farm, except, as you can see, he's a little stubborn chicken and won't lay any eggs. So, yeah. Whoa. What is that? 
Let's see. Okay, uh, whatever. I have to know. So I think I'm gonna use. There, for my shop, I want to have it look like kind of elemental and like have a lot of elements on it and it to look cool in that way. So I think another element I might use is like uh, dirt. So basically, what I've been wanting to do with these um, videos is kind of have like wait with gold guild is i don't necessarily like mining on camera because who likes watching mining i mean unless i'm getting 20 diamonds a minute then it's kind of pointless just watching me mine for no reason but so i'm deciding to do all the dirty work off camera and then i can just talk to you while I just walk around and show you everything that's been happening on the server recently. So it's like you guys' little update session thing. Yeah, I'm right next to uh, Gecko and uh, Linky. And I'm a little bit away from Maximum, but yeah. Okay, so... Thank you for watching this episode of Gold Guild, episode two. If you want to see more Gold Guild, Gold, Gold Guild, or any other episodes or stuff on my channel, please let me know in the description and tell me what you want to see on the channel. I, I'm totally open for suggestions, and thank you for watching. See y'all later. Bye.